I'm so excited. My couch is almost here and I desperately need furniture. You can't hear this, but I'm playing a song that I'm really into right now. Hold on. It's a cover of John Lennon and I'll link it down below. It's a good song. Hold on. I'm so happy right now because it's so nice out. And anyways, to prep for this sofa coming, I'm going to remove all the tape. It's unnecessary. Oh, and my chairs are gonna be done on Monday. I'm excited. <laughs> Outline. Okay. Facing. Kind of facing the kitchen. Okay. For now, at least. That's kind of the first big, bigger piece. Yeah. This and I have two chairs coming. Let me get it's mine. It's good. Yeah, I love it. It's perfect. Because there's a lot of cuts in the fabric and the way you. Right. Kind of, you know. It's perfect though. It's so good. I am a little spazzed out because it's the first piece in this place, and it feels so plain and like a big blob kind of um but i still really love it it just needs some pillows it needs like a back thing it is very comfy just just uh spazzing a little i know it's plain and i know some of you like the previous fabric but this is a good solid color i will never get sick of it's like this camel wool it's really good i don't know why i'm freaking out See, even with this view, it just reads so dark. Oh, it's good. It's good. I'm excited about it. I'm gonna do a beauty shot of this thing in the morning when the light is right. It looks good in here, but on camera, I'm nervous. I don't know why I'm nervous, who cares? Please don't rip it apart in the comments, or do. Say whatever you wanna say. Woke up today, gorgeous day out, sunny ready to film some decorating content. Went on a run, and that run basically knocked me out. It's now almost 5 p.m. I did do stuff today, but I was so tired from one run. I haven't worked out in a bit, so maybe that's it. But now that I have my sofa and the chairs come on Monday, so you'll see the chairs next week. I wanna bring the record player in over here and like kind of redo this. I need to clear out some crap. I also got some flowers or leftover branches from my shoot that I just was on that I wanna put into some vases. Um, and I also got a package of a lamp that I wanna open, so. And then I'm going to a DJ tonight, a disco DJ. So that should be fun. Today is weird and it started off good, so it's confusing. I guess I haven't shown you these bar stools, but they're not right. They're very uncomfortable and they make a, a bad sound when you sit on them. Or not a bad sound, but like a, I don't know. They're not the right height, they're not right. They're just placeholders anyways. At the estate sale tomorrow, they have some bar stools I'm gonna look at. So yeah, we, we have bar stools, but they're not, they're not them, they're placeholders, and they're not even good placeholders. They're not even comfy to sit on for me to do work. Anyways, we're down here because my vases are in this cabinet. This is my vase cabinet. Do you wanna, do you wanna see closer? Um, yeah, this is my vase cabinet. I have more vases, but um, they're scattered throughout the house. I also feel like I, I gave away some of my bigger vases to my mom because um, I was like, oh, I, I just don't need these. And now I kind of regret it. And I have a bunch of branches and I don't really have a big vase for them. So yeah, I feel like I put a pause to getting more vases because I had so many, but now I want more or bigger ones at least. So I feel like for these branches, I like this pitcher vase thing, but it has these weird holes in the side. So you can only fill the water up to like, for like an inch. And then you have to remember to refill it or else it dies. 
All right, whatever. We're going to do this one. And then I probably would pick this one, but I'm so sick of this. I've had this one for years, and I don't want this out. Um, maybe this. And then maybe we'll do like a smaller arrangement in this one. I already have flowers out. I have tulips. I need to drink more caffeine. Let's make some vase, vases. Let's make some arrangements just for my place. Okay, I changed because I don't want to be sitting in a dress while I film this video. I did just get these trousers. Can you see them? Nope. Kind of. I did just get these trousers today from Uniqlo, and I think, oh, and I think they are my new favorite pant. Oh, I don't, oh, neighbor. I don't feel like making a mess. I also have these um, tulips in this fun vase. So let's just whip some stuff together. The amount of floral arrangements I have made in my, in my lifetime. I make them all the time for sets when I'm working on set and then I always have leftover flowers so I'm making them for my, my place. I love it, it's great. I'm in such a mood today. I'm acting like this is a chore and it's just not. And it's not even a big deal because, oh God, this isn't even anything to be stressed about because these are just arrange, random ass arrangements for my, for my home. They don't even have to look good. Okay, these are dead. Oh, I do have a garbage bag back here that I need to, there's tuna in this garbage bag so it smells. I've been wanting to take that out to the trash. I have a few things to comment on while we're making these arrangements. One, I know my audio is fucked up. I don't know what to do about it. I'm f like, I film with this Rode Audio, which is a nice equipment. And sometimes it's just too far for my, my mouth, I think, and it doesn't record as well. I don't know, but I'm sorry if the audio has been, has been low on your, on your videos. I don't, I don't know. Somebody help me. I feel like I have a constant to-do list of random ass shit that, and I need help. I don't know, I don't know how to do audio, all right? This is a huge branch. Is this gonna even be able to, okay. I'll show you these arrangements uh, when I put them in place tomorrow when there's light. It's about to go dark. Second, I want to comment on my home reviews and just how nice everyone is. It's really cool to put people's homes on my channel and they all receive a ton of compliments. Like the last video, Mariana's home, the New Mexico, not New Mexico, Mexico City home. Um, people loved it and like left so many amazing comments. It's just really nice that everybody is nice. And I didn't even notice Mariana's dog in the videos until I was editing. I must have been like really focused on the design or something that I didn't even, I didn't even know that her dogs were in the shot and they're so cute. We love a little pup over here. I miss, I miss my dog so much. As you all know, the Goo, who is a star on this channel, um, she, she was so old. It, it was fine. It was fine. But yeah, she, what did, she died. Um, we had to put her down. I don't even know. This year is fucked up. This year has been all over the place. I basically, uh, yeah, there's just been a lot of change this year. But anyways, yeah, we miss the goo every day. I think about her all the time. And Mariana has some cute doggies. I think that's good. All right, I'm gonna go place these around my house. I didn't really find, I made, I ended up putting the, uh, I'll have to show you these, I can't show you right now. But I need a vase for these tulips now. And they need to be cut. I could stuff them on this. I don't know, I'll show you in the morning my arrangements when we get back from the estate sale. Hopefully I'm in a better mood. Oh my God. 
such a moody um, little bitch. <laughs> um, all right, I'm gonna go, yeah, put these, and then I'm gonna move my record player and redo this. I could, I'm not gonna film that because it sounds really boring. I'll show you what it looks like after. Unless you want me to film the boring stuff, you let me know. There's not even, it's not even gonna be that good of a before and after. It's still just a bunch of junk. I just want my record player in, in the fireplace area now since, since our little baby boy, Camel. I don't know, what should we name the couch? Do we name the couch? That we are still deciding if we like? Maybe I'm just having a hard time accepting new items into my home. I do, I do love the couch. And I don't have to worry about the goo peeing on it. So that's great. I decided I'm actually going to show you a time lapse of me sprucing up this place when I'm in a bad mood. I'm not going to talk, but I'll play, I'll play some jazzy tunes. So here you go. JK about the jazz. And sorry, my voice is raspy because I am hungover. I'm editing this and I'm hungover. What do you all think I should do about the fireplace? Should I get a cool piece of art? I'm in such a better mood today, such a better mood. It's sunny and I'm about to go to breakfast with a friend who's in town, her name is Maddie. And I ended up not getting anything from this estate sale because it wasn't, it honestly wasn't that good. I did get a robe though, because my velvet robe, which you all love, is just, it's like wearing, down. It ripped and I got it repaired and it ripped again so I think the fabric is just done. The line for the estate sale was pretty intense. Oh there's Kate made her come with me. Um, but yeah we had to wait like an hour. It was cool though I ran into someone uh, that watches my channel but yeah there wasn't that good of stuff and here are the bar stools I wanted. Too expensive. Um, couldn't really film anything. It was very crowded. Here is my first arrangement I made. Lovely. I don't really spend a ton of time on these arrangements because I'm constantly making an arrangement. So I just kind of threw it in the thing. And then we have this little tulip guy, which is kind of dying, but I, I also like the look of that. So you should, you know, I encourage, I encourage everyone to have flowers in their home. It really helps. And you don't have to spend a lot of time on it. Just throw them in a vase. Like, look at that. This one I really didn't try on as you can tell. I really just stuffed the leaves in a vase and threw it in my kitchen. So I hope you're all pleased with the outcomes. I also threw tulips in here and just put them in a water glass instead of a vase. So I don't know. I love tulips. I think tulips are one of my faves. Want to see what I actually got from the estate sale? This. This is what I got from the estate sale. A robe. <sighs> yeah, I don't, there really wasn't that good of stuff. I did find these bar stools that I really liked and I was going to get them because they were $600, but then I found out they were $600 per stool and not total. So I tried to bargain and they were like, no. And then I got this robe. And you know what? I don't know why I keep getting vintage robes. It doesn't really make sense. My friend Laura was like, you know Paige, you could just go buy a new robe. 
like a brand new robe, nice and clean. Honestly, this one feels like it's never been worn. It's kind of cheap material. It has a broken pocket. Um, and it's from Sears actually, but I really like it. And now I'm liking it even more in this view. Anyways, yeah, I was fully dressed, went to brunch, got back, and now I'm in my robe. And I think we should do a few things before um, I go to a birthday party tonight, going to a birthday party for David Yerman. He's not, it's not actually David Yerman, but we call him that. And yeah, I have the rest of the day to do stuff. So let's, op let's open this package of a light I bought. So I found this desk on Facebook Marketplace and I had it all arranged to go pick up. And then the guy like randomly the night before I was supposed to get it was like, hey, I actually sold it. I was like, what the, what the heck, dude? That was rude. He was very apologetic. Whatever, it happens. Anyways, when I got this desk, well, I thought I was getting this desk, I bought this light fixture to clip onto it. It's one of those architectural light fixtures that like clip onto your desk. So I guess I'll use it anyways, I'm sure, in my whatever desk I get for my garage or, I don't know, I'm gonna use it anyways. I've always wanted one of these clip-on architecture lamps. So it took a few weeks to get here. I'm pretty sure this is it. I didn't like confirm. I just assumed this was it. But I got it off Etsy. There's a lot of them on Etsy for you to check out if this, if this is something you want. Etsy, eBay, you know, you know the drill. Guys, I feel like a real YouTuber. My first unboxing. And I said, guys. Okay, I moved the camera over here because you can't even see what I'm doing, but this is the lamp. It's good. I really love it. You can adjust it, you know, fun stuff. Clips onto whatever table. And it does need a converter but I have such a good one that Kate actually found on Amazon. I'll link it down below if you need a converter because I feel like all of my lamps now basically need converters. Um, and it's really simple and cute and just like plugs right into your wall. But yeah, I have a lamp that has nowhere to go because I don't have a desk because Facebook Marketplace man fell through. So tell me you love it. I'm thinking I'm going to do a little Q&A in my next video because a lot of people are sending me DMs of questions of like prop styling and just random stuff. So leave any questions you have for me down below and in the next uh, like home update thing, I'll answer some cues. And if you want more prop styling content, let me know that too. Just leave me, constantly just leave me feedback. I don't know what I'm doing. I am a YouTuber now, I guess, and what does that even mean? I have no idea what I'm doing. I also have no idea what I'm doing in general in anything. Does anyone know what they're doing? No. Anyways, we'll end on this beautiful montage of my new sofa that I think we like. I like it. I like it. Goodbye. I'm now, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I wanna go get a pedicure and then I will be getting tipsy tonight. Goodbye.